Kicking us off here on stage X, Luis Vanan. Hi. Luis Vanan is a genius. He has really great ideas to solve complex problems. He knows what people want in a, in a very intuitive way. He's a scientist, an entrepreneur, and I think most uniquely a humanist. He really cares about the world and believes that education is a critical piece in, in changing the world and that everyone should have access to it. Luis is Guatemalan. Let's start with that because that's a big part of his story. Luis and I were born in Guatemala and we went to high school together. He was always the smartest person in the room, always a leader in the class. His mom was very influential from his childhood. She was devoted to him. He tells the story of his mom investing so heavily in his education. The fact that he wanted a Nintendo and instead got a computer. In Guatemala, there's a lot of inequality, a lot of poverty. You have to learn English to have better opportunities. His early experience in an English language school in Guatemala City set him on a course to go to Duke and then Carnegie Mellon, and he recognizes how privileged that experience was and has pretty much ever since tried to make that more available to more people. Luis was a professor at Carnegie Mellon, and Duolingo started as a thesis project from him and his student Severin. When we started Duolingo, Luis, even though he was very young, he was already very successful. He didn't need to work anymore. Luis had two previous companies that he sold to Google. One of them was ReCAPTCHA. I first saw a baby-faced Luis Van Ong in a TEDx presentation describing CAPTCHA and ReCAPTCHA. Luis began that talk by asking for a show of hands. How many of you found it really, really annoying? <laughs> okay, outstanding. So I invented that. <laughs> Some people don't like them too much. <sighs> you have to make sure you're not a robot, right? What we've been working on for the last year and a half is a new website. It's called Duolingo. We invested in Duolingo because Luis was so compelling. We closed the investment in October of 2011. Our first investment was over 10 years ago, and it has been an amazing ride. Duolingo is one of the most important technology companies of our time. He's created this spectacular culture that is very efficient and performance driven and yet very open and fun. We are by far the largest education app and platform in the world. There's more people learning languages on Duolingo than an entire US school system. Luis started with languages, Bonjour. but he doesn't want to stop there. The next steps are math and music, and there are other subjects that he thinks Duolingo can deliver through a similar gamified platform. Luis has found a way to reach a very large number of people with an opportunity to learn for free in a way that hasn't existed before. He's very committed to building a platform that delivers high quality education so that like him as a little boy in Guatemala, little kids everywhere can have that same access and can hopefully be a, a tool to transform their own lives. You know how successful people, they come full circle when they start giving back to society. Now he's giving back to Guatemala through his foundation. Education for Luis and for the foundation is the number one priority. We know that without an education, there's really little opportunity for individuals to have access to a better future. He wants to fix this problem of inequality, not just for Guatemala itself, but for the entire world. He has made such a massive impact in the world, and there's so much more he's going to do. Luis, congratulations on your GSV Lifetime Achievement Award. What a great accomplishment. Thank you for being such a driving force of positive impact to the world. What's up, Luis? It's Tommy Thompson here from the San Jose Earthquakes and Major League Soccer. Congratulations on your award. Aprendi Espanol con Duolingo hace cinco años. It changed my life, as well as the lives of many others across the world. Duolingo helps me to learn English in a full way and we love it. Today we want to say thank you for your commitment and congratulations!